I'm going to say what's up over here, my name is Angie, and today I'm going to view the Blueberry Bliss line by Curls, and I apologize about my intro, I don't know why, but I forgot to record it, so if you want to know how, what I thought about the products from this line, and how they react in my hair, be sure to keep watching and more subscribe. Time can never break your heart, but it'll take the pain away, right now our future's searching. Alright, so I just shampooed my hair using the normals. I used the Diva Curl Bolt Buster and I went into the hot oil treatment with my Rice Roots Hair Rex Oil. Then I did a shampoo again and now I'm up to rice water and I'm going to use my deep conditioner. So this um, deep conditioner that I have for choice is um, was also mentioned in my favorite deep conditioner video. It is the Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Mask and of course it smells like... It smells like cotton candy mixed with blueberry and sweetness. I'm going to first wet my hair, saturate it, do all of that. So I parted my hair to four, and all I have in my hair right now is the rice water. This hair mask is $9.99 at Target for 8 ounces. It prevents tears, breakage, split ends, and signs of aging. It has aloe vera that fortifies hair and improves elasticity while moisturizing for body and bounce. The blueberry extract pr protects hair and stimulates healthy hair growth. And it is also made without sulfates, parabens, or mineral oil. The directions state to cleanse curls with Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Wash, rinse, apply Blueberry Bliss. Reparative hair mask to wet hair and massage into the scalp to tangle with white tooth comb. Let the conditioner penetrate the hair shaft. Leave on for 15 minutes in the shower or 25 minutes for deep conditioning. So it's providing a good amount of slip. I have not found... I haven't found a deep conditioner that I can go like this and be done and defy, like or detangle with the white tooth comb the first time. I've not found a deep conditioner like that. I'd have to leave it on with um, heat and then let it penetrate and get warm and then I'd be able to fully tangle but no matter how moisturized the deep conditioner is, I, for the life of me I have not found a product like that so if you find a product like that let me know in the comments down below, maybe, maybe I can try it. I have high porosity hair, it's kind of fine, 3A, 3B. So I'm going to use my wide tooth comb first. I'll leave this on with my hot head for 25 minutes and then I'm going to go in with a demon brush because white tooth combs, they don't detangle my hair fully. And then I'm going to go put my plastic cap on with my hot head. I'm going to leave it on for 25 minutes just like the directions say to. And then I will show you guys what it looks like once I take the hot head off. 20 minutes later. I just took off my hot head and it's been 25 minutes and I'm going to let you guess right now what I'm going to use to detangle. I'll wait. It is kind of a hard guess because I barely ever use it. Sarcasm there. I'm going to go rinse it out with cold water and then I will be back to apply the silent products. So why not just tell a story? A couple months ago I used the um, Blueberry Bliss Control Jelly with the Blueberry Bliss Sleep Conditioner. Can I just tell you, when I put it in my hair and I let it dry, my hair felt so I don't know if it was because maybe I applied too much and I was heavy handed because I am kind of heavy handed with my products, especially back then. It felt like if you applied gel onto your hair for a whole two weeks and you did not wash it. Like, this is what my hair looks like right now and it says apply it to wet or dry hair, the leave conditioner. I'm going to apply it to wet hair. I'm going to get this for now. This leave conditioner is $11.99 at Target for 8 ounces. And it's hard working, texture softening, moisturizing, reparative, and detangling as a leave conditioner. The directions say to apply blue ray bliss reparative leave conditioner to wet or dry hair. Whenever moisture and conditioning is needed, great prepping product to apply before styling, twisting, braiding, or creating updos. I'm gonna try not to use my Devon brush right now because um, I remember that I have a brush that I used for this. As reliable as possible, it is blue, just to let you guys know, it's kind of thick. Alright, so this is a quarter size. To me, it is a quarter size. It still smells the same, it smells a little bit more blueberry. I'm not going to rate this, and I'm just going to scrunch. 
This jelly is 1569 at Target for 8 ounces. It is a curling gel formula. It is also infused with blueberry extract. It is sulfate, silicone, and paraben free and is also for all hair types. The directions for day one say to apply the jelly to freshly cleanse and conditioned hair while it is still wet. Scrunch it to hair section by section, allow it to air dry. And then day two says to refresh your curls with lavish curls, moisturizer, and reapply blueberry bliss curl control jelly as needed. So this is what my hair looks like. Hopefully it does not give me this sticky mess that it gave me last time because right now it is defined as heck. Like, like I'm trying not to hate this product because right now the results, if it stays like this, maybe this will be like a cult favorite of mine. Especially without a demo brush, this is crazy. Like the amount of definition I'm getting right now. It is kind of providing small curl clumps, but still they're equally defined. What it looks like a finished one while it is wet. So for this side, I'm going to apply only the curling jellies. I'm noticing that this doesn't have a lot of slip when applied alone. So you would have to make sure your hair is fully tangled with any product that you like if you're not going to apply leave and conditioner before this, but I fully recommend you apply leave and conditioner before this. because I'm going to have to go with my demo brush, um, unfortunately. This is not doing anything for me. And this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like over on here, this side. This is with the leave conditioner and the curl control jelly. I'm going to go use my wig cap. I'm going to leave that on for as long as it takes. I still haven't determined how long that takes currently, but I'm going to leave it on until it is almost 80% dry. Two hours later. Okay, so my hair is 70% dry on this side, 80% dry on this side. So I'm gonna go diffuse this, and so far, look at that definition. We need to have a serious discussion because this is not right. I waited months and months because I didn't like this product combination, and I thought. That something was wrong with it. I literally thought that this this jelly right here, this culprit right here, was the devil. And I even commented that on other pictures people used it because I didn't like it and I thought it didn't work. My hair, I think it's on its period because it's changing its mind and I'm sick of it. <laughs> literally, look at my hair. Like, do you see this? I haven't separated yet, so this is like, just finished diffusing. I'm gonna let you guys decide. What, which side do you like better? This is the side that I use with the jelly only. This is the side that I use with the leave and shop. I feel like there is a difference between using this alone and using it with the leave and conditioner. I think the leave and conditioner side looks more better and they both have the same amount of hold but I feel like this side looks more better, more uniform and everything. This side looks okay. I also was able to get a lot more slip when applying the, the products when I used the leave and conditioner rather than when I just went in with the jelly. So just to be aware of that. I will definitely, definitely think about repurchasing this. Um, maybe I'll use these products for like a special occasion where it's not a long time. I'm, I'm not going to want my style to last for a long time, maybe like about three days or so. Because this, I can refresh with this because it says day one, day two, including the leave conditioner. Even the deep conditioner, I'll give it five or five stars. It did all that it uh, promised. It soft, the deep conditioner softened. Yes, it did. It detangled. Um, moisturized, it did moisturize my hair a lot. I felt like it was penetrating and everything. Conditioned and hydrated your curls, yes. Repairing damage, I don't have damage in my hair currently, so I cannot speak on that point, but it does have protein in it, so if you have damage, you can try it out and see how it works on that. Protects against breakage, I can't speak on that currently. Encouraging hair growth, I don't use this every week to claim whether or not it for, uh, truly encourages hair growth. The Blueberry List Curls Control Jelly, it is it's supposed to defrizz. Barely see any frizz in my hair whatsoever, like no frizz at all. Um, currently, define it, girl. My curls are so defined right now. It's insane. Hold. It's a light hold. Light. Even medium is 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 like far reaching. It's definitely not medium. It's just a light hold. So, so you could determine whether or not you like the product based on that information um, creates curls in place yes my curls look uniform look so gorgeous 
and with impeccable sheen my hair looks shiny as hell so and finally the leave-in conditioner so leave-in conditioner it says that it is texture softening it did soften my hair a lot it moisturizes hell yeah it says i this is one of my favorite leave-in conditioners so um it repairs i don't have damage right now, so i can't speak on that either it detangles it's a detangling conditioner this is like on the top besides the Noche jesse curl uh, conditioner this is like one of the top leave conditioners that I really like that it, it was truly helps with detangling. So I will give this whole line a five out of five stars that is very rare on my channel because I am kind of brutal with this. Like if you don't define my hair, if you don't give me hold, I will take one point off or half a point off, whatever I need to do. But this line, it is perfection. Besides the jelly, I wish it did give hold, but again, jellies are more of a lighter hold than actual gels. So I will just show you the results again. And right here, I will insert a picture of what my hair looks like fluffed and everything was just fully dry and def um, and separated the curls and everything, so. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you did enjoy this video, be sure to subscribe so you can see more content in store for you guys in the future. And if you do subscribe, be sure to hit the notification button down below so you can not fight every single time I upload a new video. I upload every Sunday. And comment down below if you're willing to try these products. And... Be sure to share this video if you enjoyed it, and remember to wear a crown, not a crown, and stay beautiful, and love you guys. Bye!